Hey everybody, it's Lindsay Petch here again from Maple Street Guitars, and today we're here to compare two very distinctive Collings OMs. The first guitar is this beautiful OM2E with Koa back and sides. Koa is a somewhat unusual tone wood for Collings. They do use it off and on and have used it in the past, but this guitar has some exceptionally fine, beautifully curled Koa. And since Collings no longer builds with cedar tops, we thought it would be a really cool idea to put an Engelman top on this guitar. Engelman spruce has a lot of the tonal complexity and a slightly softer response, much like a cedar, and yet it has a little more punch and drive, so it's a very fitting complement for Koa, which has a little bit of brighter response with a little stronger mid-range presence. Next up is an OM-1 cutaway with a German spruce top. Now, Collings has used Adirondack on a lot of mahogany guitars in the past. It's a tone wood combination that they like a lot. But recently, we've been ordering a lot of guitars with German spruce tops. And on a smaller body mahogany guitar, we think this is a really nice choice. The red spruce is so stiff that it can require a little bit more break-in period. Yet, German spruce is a little bit softer, still delivers a lot of the drive, and sounds a little bit more like a broken-in guitar. So. Apart from the German spruce top, this guitar also has a lovely Style 1 sunburst cutaway and a 1 and 3 quarter inch nut, so it's a real hot rod.
So once again, this has been Lindsay Petch here at Maple Street Guitars with a comparison of two beautiful Collings OMs, a body size very near and dear to my heart as it's one of the most versatile that money can buy. If you'd like to learn more about either of these two guitars, please give us a call or visit us online at maplestreetguitars.com.